Hey YouTube, Smoking Uncle Frank here. How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's having a great weekend. I was planning on doing a video and then I saw another video and I thought, well, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna kill two birds with one stone. Uh, New Jersey pipe smoker. He's got a Warner Hub sub gaw giveaway. So I thought I'd do a little VR to him anyway. Um, win or lose, whatever. Um, he asked the question to do a VR and put it up on his channel. If I had a, uh, if, what was my, well, something about the favorite vacation place, favorite place to be when you're relaxing, uh, other than home, he said, well, you know, that kind of, <laughs> my favorite place to be when I'm on vacation is right here. But if I had a choice to go somewhere, could afford to go somewhere for a vacation, I think it would have to be Europe. It would have to be either either um, England or um, Ireland. I'd, I'd love to go to Ireland because I'd love to go go and visit the um, Peterson Pipe Factory. Uh, if they have tours of it, I don't know, but it would. I think that would be really interesting because I I love Peterson Pipes. So um, and uh, anyway, and I also was thinking. I was thinking of my uh, my next giveaway, which is probably going to be a long time away. I'm up to 300 sub, over a little, a couple over 300 subs now. So um, I appreciate it. Um, thanks to everybody that's um, subscribed to me. A um, couple of shout outs. Um, let me get my phone app here and go to my, because I can't remember their names, but I wanted to just uh, let them know I appreciate it, and I hit the wrong one. So okay, I'm gonna go back here. I, I hit the wrong button. I hit the YouTube button instead of the um, instead of that. And I got a I got a visitor on my lap too. She wants to she wanted to come visit with me, but now I'm 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 moving around too much. So it's like all right, forget it. I'm leaving <sighs> because I'm 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 bouncing around in the chair doing my video to you. So let's see, where was it? I was looking at so many things and I got all these pages open. Here we go. Here we go. My recent subscribers, uh, shout out to Pipe Smoking Cowboy Chris. Thanks for subbing. Um, Red Coat Return, thanks for subbing. Uh, Hard crackers number one, I guess it is said. Uh, thanks for subbing, buddy. And uh, Christine Stevenson. And then, um, oh, I got JP Gamer. I guess uh, you must have saw some of my gaming stuff too, because I like video games, but I'm not going to do any video games today, even though I would like to. Um, I'm not going to talk about that. I'm going to talk about. I'm going to talk about tobacco. Um, I opened this up. I had this in my cellar for. Oh, about two and a half years. I bought this two and a half years ago. I bought this um, back in 17. I didn't realize it was that long. Uh, Mississippi River Special Reserve. And I haven't smoked it. I hadn't smoked it until, well, I was going to do a can opening for you, but you know what? I'm sorry. I couldn't resist the temptation. I had to smoke some of it. My preferred method, because, uh, well, I'll show you. This is a uh, not really a plug, it's more of a crumble cake. I'll show you. I'm sure you've all seen it, but for those of you who haven't, and it comes in a pretty big chunk though. You get a big, big old brownie there. Uh, it's a four ounce, four ounce plug. So it's, it's, it's a nice size, uh, nice size plug. Tin note, earthy. I guess a little figgy or plummy or something in there. It's got some sweetness to it in aroma anyways. Um, and what does it say about the tobacco? Uh, Mississippi Ri uh, River Special Reserve. I have blended, I've been dreaming of, of this special reserve edition of Mississippi River for a long time. It's my treat for all of you who love Mississippi River. Well, Mississippi River is good, yeah. We found that we found the rarest leaf uh, for my special reserve. It's pressed in cakes, long age and cut. 
and to plug for, for you to slice or crumble as you please. This is my favorite way to enjoy uh, pressed, pressed tobacco. The Virginia in this blend is some of the best I've ever smoked and the rare Latakia and aged Turk, Turk, Turkish and a bit of a bit of St. James Perique make me a very make me very happy too. Makes me pretty happy. Uh, hope you enjoy my special reserve Mississippi River Joe Langford. So, Joe, I enjoy your special your special reserve. Um, in fact, I was looking on the website, but now and I see that they got some barrel aged stuff too. So, hmm. I'm I'm gonna wait though because uh, I gotta get some 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 bills paid before I go spending any more money. And I've got probably I don't know thirty or forty pounds of tobacco in my cellar right now. I haven't counted it, but I've got a lot. I cut it, but I the way I like to cut it. I know they make special devices for cutting, but, uh, mm, 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 mm. you know, I like to cut it with something like this. I, I I can get a nice good pressure down on the thing and then I'll cut it into, I try to cut it into, into flake. Well, as you can see though, this, this stuff here is, is very, very crumbly. I mean, it just, it just breaks apart really, really well. So I'm gonna fill a bowl. I've been letting this dry out for a little while here. I was thinking as I was talking about my next my next giveaway, and I was thinking to myself, you know, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this, so don't 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 get your hopes up, guys. This is this is my uh I'm thinking about doing a special uh I, I ordered um backtracking a little bit. I ordered um the matches eight six zero, um the special pipe that uh, the pipe nook is if you if you don't know about it, the pipe nook. Oh, there's a nice flake. Uh, the pipe nook. Uh, they they contact. I guess he contacted um, Savinelli and said he wanted to commemorate uh, John John Harden, who recently passed away. As you all know, if you don't, well, then where where have you been? Uh, great guy. I'm. Really was really sorry to hear about it. Um, he'll be missed. But uh, anyway, I I ordered one of the pipes because I I always kind of wanted one of that one of that style, and and now it's 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 kind of something to just to remember and buy. You know, every time I smoke it, it'll be my uh, I doubt it'll be my Friday night Savinelli, but it'll it'll definitely be my um my Savinelli. I don't know, maybe my Saturday night Savinelli. I, I don't want to steal that from him. <laughs> I can't just just can't take that. Can't take that away from him. You know, it's, it'll still be considered a Friday night Savinelli as far as John is concerned. But uh, I'm going to let him have that Friday night uh, thing and, and make it my own. Uh, but but uh, he'll be missed. Anyway, um, let me put this away. Uh, you can see how well it crumbles up all there. I, it just falls apart the minute you cut it. Get your tail out of the way, cat. You're going to be dipping into my tobacco with your tail and flicking it all over the place. So, I was thinking that somewhere in the future, I'm up to, like I said, I'm up to 300 subs. I'm probably going to wait until I, if I can, if I can order another one, depending, uh, it all depends on, on the gods that be or whatever you want to call it. Um, of whether or not I can afford another $115. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that. We'll see what my see we'll see what the government gives me back this year and then maybe, I don't know, maybe I might I might just get another one and then just stash it away. And when I get up to eight hundred and sixty subs because of matches eight six zero, I will do a giveaway on that. If I get the pipe. No promises. If I don't, well, then we'll we'll figure that out later. But uh, I just wanted to throw that out there. I I, I don't know what's going to happen in the future. I can't plan the future. I might not even be around. For all I know, I might be there with John. Then who knows? I hope not. But um, and if I but if I am, we'll be up there having a good pipe smoke together and laughing about all the good times.
Unfortunately, he lived in Connecticut, so I never met him. But he he definitely inspired inspired me uh, to make him, him and a, him and a couple other people inspired me in my my journey on YouTube and making videos. So so here I am. I'm the stupid old man with the pipe in his hand that he can't light and and talking about pipe tobacco. Nice tobacco, though. Very nice tobacco. A um, little bit, little bit smoky. Very smooth, though. Uh, if you smoke, if you ever smoked Mississippi River, and then smoked a bowl of this, there's a definite, there's a definite difference. Uh, this is, this is much, much, this is much better than than the Mississippi. I like the Mississippi River, but uh, a little more periky or something. I don't know. Maybe because aged and, it, and, and set for a while that, that it toned it down some and you know I've mentioned that I'm not a big Perique fan I'm, I, I like Perique in very small quantities a little, little dab just to, a little dab will do you kind of to, to, to just kind of uh, spice it up a little bit because that's all it really is to me it's a kind of it, it's a pipe tobacco condiment it's like putting salt and pepper in your in your in your beans or whatever to me I, I don't know that's my way of looking at it. And I'm smoking it in my Viking. Bought this a long time ago at, uh, uh, I think I bought it at Ewan Reese. So, uh, God, it had to have been, that it would have had to have been back in the uh, 80s. Something like that. Got it out of a basket. It was just a basket pipe. Mm -hmm. wasn't wasn't terribly expensive, but uh, I like it. It's a nice little, nice. It's got a nice thick, nice thick walls on it, and it smokes smokes really well. I don't know. I think they lacquered this one or something, or they they coated it with something because it's always been shiny. I, I don't I don't put nothing on this or anything to make it glossy like that. It just but it never bubbles. It's never bubbled up on me or anything. So I don't know how they treated it, but they did a good job. Whoever, whatever Viking did with it. I pretty much use anything that's available as a tamper. This isn't even a tamper. This is a this is actually a file handle for a watchmaker's files. You you put a little you can put the put the you put the uh, you see the hole there. You just but it works well as a tamper too. I brought it home for for something else I had in mind because I had so many of the dog mom things at work. So I just grabbed that and then now all of a sudden it's become a tamper. Whatever works. Sometimes I don't have a tamper up. Yeah, I, I've got cal enough calluses on my fingers. I can handle it. I'll just tap it with a finger. It's this thing here that will get me, though, sometimes when I'm out in the wind. And the, the wind catches this flame, and boy, oh, boy, it, it'll lick over your hand. And whoa, well, I throw my lighter across the street one time almost. No. Well, that's about it. New Jersey Piper. Uh, subscribe to him. Uh, he's, 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 you're really coming along well, well, buddy. Um, like I said, uh, I guess it would, it would probably be a uh, choice between England and, and, um, and Ireland. I think if I could go to Ireland, if I had the money to go there, that would be my vacation spot. That would be my, that would be my, uh, my dream place to go in, in a couple of days. I, I doubt I'd be able to sort of, be able to afford a week or anything like that. I don't doubt I'd even be able to afford a couple of days. Uh, hey, you know, I'm just an old man living in a trailer, just barely getting by. So, you know, when I spend way more money than I ha more money than I need to spend, I, 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 I get a little bit, 
you know, I got to watch myself. I got to say no to myself sometimes. And sometimes Frank don't listen to Frank. So a lot of times you don't. But anyway, that's about it. If you haven't smoked it, get yourself a tin of this here. It's it's pretty dang good. I'd like to try that uh, that that uh, that barrel aged stuff though. I think I'm gonna look up some and see if there's any reviews on it and see what other people have to say about it. I'm not sure, but. The pictures on on the website show it on smoking on um, pipes and cigars show it with a block of wood on top. So I'm wondering if they put a piece of the barrel in there, kind of like uh, well, you know who? Um, uh, can't think of his name right now, but they're no longer around. They made uh, Christmas blend, the the uh, Christmas cheer, and all that. And I'm I'm having a brain aneurysm right now, so I can't remember. It the name of them, and I'll, I'll think about it later, and I'll remember, but you know who I'm talking about, so I think maybe they might have stole some, stole some of his idea there to, to throw a piece of uh, the barrel in there with the tobacco, to, so we'll see what it's like, I have to see what it's like, to see if it's any good, like I need another new favorite, I got so many doggone, I mean, look at my you should, if you could see my table here, I, I'm not going to try to lift it, but I got this big box sitting here, and it's 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 like this, and it's full full of jars of tobacco next to me. That's just stuff I have near me to smoke. The rest is I got more up in a cabinet there, and I got kitchen table, and I got stuff that, and I got God knows how much in my in my tri in my uh in my back closet there, my little cellar that I got. I, I probably got enough. Sp Tobacco will last me for, for a, I don't know, 10 years at least. <laughs> five at least. Five minimum. Five, five minimum. Ten, probably, maybe maybe ten. Maybe ten. I don't know. I, I smoke a lot, so who knows. Anyhow, that's about it for now. I hope everybody has a great weekend. Um, time is really catching up here. I've been babbling on for 17, almost 18 minutes now, so I'm going to sign off. Smoking Uncle Frank and my, my, my cell and partner over here are going to say goodbye. Wish everybody had, I wish everybody to have a great weekend. Um, relaxable. Enjoy the day. Signing out. Bye-bye, all.